All right, so I think this video is gonna be something like, I had this idea of using this video to show to you certain things that happened to me, uh, more of like how I feel about the previous video to the next video. There is a lot that you don't see, right, in my life. I'm not saying that my life is important or excited for people to, to, to be documented or anything like that. But what I mean is this is more for myself, for like a, my own self checkup, I guess. Like the previous video, which, which uh, it's at the moment is the one that it's almost done and I'm about to do the thumbnail. But once this video is out, this video that I'm editing will be out first. So this is what comes after. So when I write something, it takes a while. And then if I leave that script alone for, for like a few weeks and I go back to it, there's always something I wanna change, right? And that's something curious to, to explore. Why do I feel like, oh, there's always something, there's always something to improve, right? You go there and you have a different set of mind or a different perspective. And I believe that that is because you change as a person. Every day you change, every week, every month, every year you change. And this is the reason why I'm making this video. This is a transition from my own self who wrote that like two months ago and then filmed it a month ago. And then you're, I'm about to make the next video. It's a big jump. It's a big jump. It, it's, it's a big jump for me. It feels like a big jump because I know I've changed. For the YouTube, it's gonna be a big jump but in a different way, right? It's gonna be like, whoa, whoa, your hair is big now? Like, you know, that's something you can see. But for me, because I'm editing myself, I see more than hair, more than growing hair. Like I see something that is not physical, I see I see my actions, I see my behaviors, I see my energy, you know, and this previous video, I definitely felt so many things and, you know, I was depressed, I, I, I wasn't too confident about what I was doing, um, you know, it took me a while to get that fun, that passion back and I think uh, making this video I found, I figured out what is fun for me, you know, the fun for me wasn't the energy, it wasn't like, you know, like, oh, I'm so excited, like, that wasn't fun, like, I think the fun for me was being calm and relaxed, to trust myself that I can do it, you know, like making this video and trying to be calm, which I think I am, and just trust my own words and trust my own voice and like, yeah. So that is something that I kind of wanted to put in this video as a transition from my own self from the past, like a month ago or two months ago, from now the next video that will, will be out, I don't know when, but that's how I want you to see me the next video. I take my time to make videos uh, I take time not because I want to perfect them. I naturally want to make them good and I take my time for that, obviously, but I take my time more specifically for my mental health and, and, and other stuff. I, I just, I put too much pressure on myself and there's no reason for that, right? Like, there was so many times I tried to do YouTube and I stopped and I wasn't happy with something and, you know, I didn't feel like I was being me, I was faking or I was pretending and now I'm just taking it easy. I'm taking it easy, you know. I don't have to pressure myself or stress about anything because it's like I'm doing this, I'm doing this for free. You know, like no one's paying me, no one is forcing me, like it's my own self. And so um, 
this is how I want to make my stuff. Uh, I, I, I think like if in the future, hopefully if I, if I get more comfortable, more confident, I probably will start making more stuff consistently, but I, but that will happen naturally. I don't want to force that, that way, you know, um, and I'm being very, very honest about it. Like I don't, I, I stop caring about consistency and algorithm and becoming famous or rich. Like I just don't care anymore. Like I, I'm tired of that because it's just, it doesn't make me happy. It makes me the opposite. And I actually like to make videos and I always wanted to make videos and I kind of lost that passion or that dream because of stuff that didn't matter, stuff that it wasn't even real or, you know, all very delusional things. For for last thing to end this video, I want to talk about the previous video where most of my stuff that I wrote went fine and I'm very, very happy about that. There was only one thing and then went fine and I just didn't put it in the video, but it would be nice to just talk about it. And, and that was me. I wrote this um, cool part for McPatty to wake up me in bed uh, at around midnight. So this was uh, during the night, it was dark. And that was one of the reasons why I didn't like it. it the lighting wasn't good. I didn't have enough light and it was too dark. It looked very crappy. I was trying to use a VFX um, technique, which was a, a wire technique to levitate a box, uh, a Big Mac box. McPaddy comes in in a room and he's like, hey, I have to show you this. And he wakes up H.S. Thomas and, and he's like, dude, I just want to go to sleep. And uh, McPaddy is like, no, but it just, just takes a few seconds. Look, look. And he's just like, if he, you know, he, he throws a box and he levitates, right? So the, the, the way I've done this was with wires. Obviously, I already said that. But I use also hooks that you can, like, you know, hooks that you can buy to stick in the walls and you can put, like, your towel or anything. So I use hooks to the walls, like, to the top walls. And I put the wires uh, in the box. And I, then I just, you know, did this. And the box would, like, move. I have... I have videos and and i recorded because it was fun to make it it was it was fun to make it obviously but i was stressing you know that was like that's what i mean like i was stressing like i was just not confident about that it was just hard work it's okay to be hard work but it, i wasn't taking it in, in a positive way and so and i think that was after that making that and editing that i probably got a bit depressed and i got a bit you know not not good um i thought about doing it again in a different environment maybe like more lights and stuff like that but i couldn't be bothered and so i left it uh, but i still have this video now to talk about that fun experience well fun experience i mean it wasn't that fun the way i felt it but but now it's fun to talk about it you know like it's fun now to, for this video like i can use this video to, to, to talk about what felt and also what went right because not everything is perfect. Not everything goes well as you plan and that's okay. You know, like, like making this video, this microphone wasn't working. It was like the time just freezed and so I lost all my, pro my progress. <laughs> and, and so this is probably my third or fourth video because I was trying to just be honest and this thing would just freeze at uh, three minutes and I had like 20 minutes of video and I was like, oh, I have no audio now. So now it's working. So I have 10 minutes of content. So hopefully I have all of it. And yeah, I guess this is all. I don't want to drag much. This is it. So I'll see you in the next one.